here in the i button and in description box below you will get the complete playlist of z transforms welcome to video number 5 and in this particular video we are going to solve a very important problem that is find the z transform of the following first is n plus 1 whole square and the second one is sin 3 n plus 5 we will solve one by one so first start with this solution yeah, so in the first part that is we need to find the z transform of this n plus 1 whole square what we need to do first is we have to open this bracket okay here we have n plus 1 whole square we know a plus b whole square is a square plus 2ab plus b square so this is going to be z transform of n square plus 2n plus 1 fine now we will separate this by the help of linearity property so we know that this is going to be how much z transform of n square plus 2 is a constant value so 2 into z transform of n plus z transform of 1 okay now we have already found the that is z transform of 1 is z upon z minus 1 z transform of n is z upon z minus 1 whole square and again we also have z transform of n square that is z square plus z upon z minus 1 whole cube we are going to put the values over here so this is going to be yes z transform of n square this is how much z square plus z upon z minus 1 whole cube we are writing 2 here z transform of n that is how much z upon z minus 1 whole square and we know that z transform of 1 is z upon z minus 1 ok so now here we can see the denominator z minus 1 whole cube here the denominator z minus 1 whole square here the denominator part is z minus 1 so we can take lcm as z minus 1 whole cube now this is going to be as it is that is z square plus z plus here we need to write first 2 into z into z minus 1 plus here we have z and here we have z minus 1 so this is going to be z into z minus 1 whole square now in the next step what we are going to do is opening this bracket and expanding this so this is going to be z square plus z plus this is going to be 2 z square minus 2 z okay now this is going to be plus z into z square minus 2 z plus 1 fine upon z minus 1 whole cube now again in the next step we are going to open this bracket so this is going to be z square plus 2z square that is 3z square here we have z minus 2z that is minus z ok plus this is going to be z cube ok this is going to be z cube minus 2z square plus z upon z minus 1 whole cube now here we can see z z gets cancelled what is left over here that is this is going to be z cube 3 z square minus 2 z square that is plus z square upon z minus 1 whole cube now again we can take common that is z square what is left over here that is z plus 1 upon z minus 1 whole cube so this is the z transform of n plus 1 whole square ok so this is going to be the answer of first part now coming to the second part that is we need to find the z transform of sin 3n plus 5 now let us start solving the second part that is sin 
Pn plus 5. First of all, know, we have to know that what is the formula for sin A plus B. So, sin A plus B equals to sin A into cos B plus cos A into sin B. This is the formula. Here, if you compare this with this, we are going to get A equals to 3 and B equals to 5. Okay. So, now we are going to find the Z transform of sin Pn plus 5. Now, this is going to be Z transform of what is A that is 3N, what is B that is 5. So, this is going to be sin Pn into cos 5 plus cos 3N into sin 5. Okay. Now, here we have sin 3N. Here we have cos 3N. This part is constant. Sin, sin 5, cos 5, both are constant. But here we have sin 3n and here we have cos 3n. So we need to we need to have the formula of the transform of sin n theta and we also must have the formula for the transform of cos n theta. Okay. So that we can apply here and this part. Now if you compare this with this, the theta is 3. Again, compare this with this, we will get theta equals to 3. So, the formula is z into sin theta upon, there is something in the denominator part. And here we have z into z minus cos theta upon, there is something in the denominator part. And both have, both the denominator part are same. What is that? That is z is square minus 2z cos theta plus 1. Again write the same thing here. That is z square minus 2z cos theta plus 1. Okay. The formula is very simple. Now we are going to apply this here. This is the formula. Now again on applying. This is going to be. This part is constant. So we can write cos 5 into what is sine z transform of sine pn that is this z into sine 3 upon z square minus 2 z cos what, what is theta that is what is theta that is 3 that is 3 plus 1 plus coming to this part again we can see sine 5 is constant so we can write here sine 5 into what is cos 3 theta cos 3n that is cos n theta that is z into z minus cos theta what is theta that is 3 okay theta equals how much 3 so cos 3 upon same part that is because theta is 3 so this is going to be z square minus 2z cos 3 plus 1 Fine. Now we can see the denominator part is same. So we can combine this. Okay. So this is going to be z square minus 2z cos 3 plus 1. In the numerator part we have z into sin 3 cos 5. z into sin 3 into cos 5. Plus, here we can have z square into sin 5, that is z square into sin 5 plus minus minus z into sin 5 cos 3, that is 0 we can write z into z into cos 3 sin 5. Okay, now. Here we have z and here we have z. Okay, so taking z common, we can write this as sine 3 into cos 5 minus cos 3 into sine 5. Okay, now this term is as it is that is z square into sine 5 upon 
जेड स्क्वायर माइनस टू जेड कॉस थ्री प्लस वन नो वी कैन सी व्हाट इज द फॉर्मूला फॉर साइन ए कॉस बी माइनस कॉस ए साइन बी दैट इज साइन ए माइनस बी अगेन आई एम रिपीटिंग साइन ए माइनस बी इक्वल्स टू साइन ए कॉस बी माइनस कॉस ए साइन बी सो दिस इज गोइंग टू बी जेड इंटू साइन ए माइनस बी वॉट इज ए थ्री वॉट इज बी फाइव सो हियर वी कैन राइट थ्री माइनस फाइव प्लस हियर वी हैव जेड स्क्वायर इंटू साइन फाइव अपॉन वी हैव दैट इज जेड स्क्वायर माइनस टू जेड कॉस थ्री प्लस वन नाउ वी कैन री राइट दिस एज वॉट इज साइन थ्री माइनस फाइव दैट इज साइन ऑफ साइन ऑफ माइनस टू एंड वॉट इज साइन ऑफ माइनस थीटा दैट इज माइनस साइन थीटा ओके वी नो दिस सो दिस इज गोइंग टू बी हाउ मच दैट इज माइनस जेड साइन टू ओके प्लस जेड स्क्वायर इंटू साइन फाइव अपॉन जेड स्क्वायर माइनस टू जेड कॉस थ्री प्लस वन वी कैन टेक जेड कॉमन सो दिस इज गोइंग टू बी जेड इंटू साइन फाइव एंड हियर वी हैव माइनस साइन टू एंड इन द डिनोमीटर पार्ट वी हैव एज इट इज दैट इज जेड स्क्वायर माइनस टू जेड कॉस थ्री प्लस वन ओके एंड दिस इज द फाइनल answer thank you thank you so much